hello everybody how are you and happy new year to you and your family this video has been made on the first of january 2020 what a lovely year to be so what's the best time your best way to start a new year that trust me the best to start a new year is with a lovely lovely beautiful skin so today i'm going to show you how to make your own fish hair rejuvenating oil using one of my favorite oil in the world this oil is very beautiful this uh, fish hair rejuvenating oil is a cleansing formula okay so it's, it's going to be a cleansing oil in that we want to use it okay to clear how to clean our pores and uh, replace the dirty oils with uh, all natural clean oil so here is my formula and this is what you need I have a link in the description box below for where you can get any of this oil so we're going to need sweet almond oil we're going to need five gram <clears throat> we're going to need roast hip oil we're going to need two gram then we're going to need uh, lavender essential oil very good for the face we're going to need 0 0.5 gram we're going to need vitamin E oil very good antioxidant we're going to need uh, one gram of that so you ask me what's the purpose of this like i said before you're going to use it to clean your face you're going to use it to further clean your pores uh, to remove dirt and make sure you know you get rid of bacteria and you know you replace the bad oil <coughs> okay there may be clogging your pores with clean oil so this is what you do so sweet almond oil, rosy oil, lavender, and, and vitamin E oil. I will show you how to use it later, um, later in this video, but I'll make it short and sweet. So you know, I'm going to use a beaker. You wonder what I use a beaker? I'm a skincare formulator, formulator skincare product. So I use, we're going to use, remember we're going to use DIY 2.0, but we're not going to follow, um, we're not going to follow the percentage formula today. We are going to we will follow that in another video because we don't want to make too much of this oil you take uh, you turn on your weight if you have not bought any of this weight uh, we will have a link in the description box below for where you can get it it's very cheap on Amazon you can get it and trust me it's a very good way uh, you're going to make sure you turn on tear okay put in your beaker or whatever you want to use to wear your oil turn on tear it's going to reset the skin then we're going to put in five gram five gram of uh, sweet almond oil that's the first on our list sweet almond oil so five gram followed by two gram of rosehip oil we're going to turn on the tear again we're going to have two grams of rosehip oil this oil is going to do wonder on your skin it's it's helping building uh, collagen okay so we turn on the tear again then we're going to add our vitamin E oil vitamin E oil is an antioxidant we're going to use one gram All this oil combined together will give you your face a glow you have to make sure you keep using this especially at night okay make sure you use this especially at night <coughs> excuse me then finally we're going to so we've added sweet almond Rose Eep. 
provided sweet almond roast eep we've added uh, vitamin he oil the next we're going to add is lavender we're going to add 0.5 gram of lavender essential oil i'll make that um, six drops of uh, lavender essential oil Six, uh, six drops of lavender essential oil. Then we're going to mix them together thoroughly. Try and make sure you use your gloves. Okay, when formulating any product for the skin, it's highly essential we we'll follow good uh, manufacturing practices, even though we make this at home. Okay, it's very essential. So after mixing it then you're going to you're going to pour in a dropper bottle, okay? Pour in a dropper bottle if possible or you can pour in any bottle you have. But when you have a dropper bottle like this, it's made it's very easy to control the amount you will be using. So I have a link in the description box below for everything you will need to make this oil. So you pour it in. And you just uh, label it. Make sure you keep it tight locked. You don't need to keep this in the fridge. There's no water in it so we, you don't need any preservatives. You don't need to put it in the fridge. We can just, you know use this as long as you want at least it should last you depending on the uh, expiration date of your oil for example this is uh, expiring 2020 so depending on the expiration date of all the oils in this thing so um that will determine how when it will expire so we're going to put we're going to label it facial rejuvenating Cleansing oil for my skin care coin. We're going to label it and keep that safe and secured so the review. Now the fun part is the application part very important that you know how to apply this for it to be effective you don't just want to make oil you want to also know how to apply it now I'm going to show you now using my favorite mannequin okay let's get this out of the way now to apply this oil You're going to rub rub it on the skin one or two drops okay rub it on your face rub it on your face and we're going to allow it to so just like so I have it rub one or two drops on your face I'll still show you on this mannequin okay then allow it to rest for at least two to five no not two make sure you let it rest for five minutes let it rest for five minutes I'm going to show it again on the mannequin make sure you avoid the sensitive high area rub it on the face Then after five minutes, <coughs> take an handkerchief and run it under hot tap water. I mean, warm tap water. Don't let it be. I don't want you to hurt your own skin. So run it under hot tap water. Then use it. Okay. So let's say this is a wet handkerchief. Now it's wet with hot water. 
and after five minutes just use it to like in a wiping format just use it to wipe to wipe the oil okay you don't really have to wipe it or you can just use it to make sure the water is warm not hot use it on it you just use it to cover your cover the face that's all that's a just gentle you know wiping that's all you do that's exactly what you do after five minutes okay just gentle touch not your your goal is not to really take the oil off the goal is to help the oil sink further into the pore okay so just use it to touch it you may necessarily not wipe it just make sure there is uh, warm water on the handkerchief fish a uh, fish cloth you are using so just use it to touch 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 and that will leave your face feeling really good and refreshed trust me after using this for a couple of weeks you know you notice you know difference in your, in your skin this oil is beautiful it helps to build a help in cell rejuvenation and control breakout very very good it's going to improve the elasticity of the skin uh, thereby giving you a younger looking skin radiant skin make sure you do that if possible at night for some minutes before you go to bed so do that every night some minutes before you go to bed if you need a, a place to find any of these uh, or any of the ingredients I used today all the oils I used today look in the description box below remember you can use it at least six to eight months depending on the expiration date of your oil so don't forget follow this instruction especially when you are washing the final part when you are cleaning it make sure you follow the instruction very well so as to make it effective right ever if you have any question feel free to drop in the comment box below here are the ingredients i use i use sweet almond oil i use lavender essential oil i use roasted oil then i use vitamin e oil vitamin e oil i have a link in the description box below for all the oils i use remember your skin is the largest organ in your body make sure you take proper care of it this is your outer representative you know it's boost self-esteem it boost confidence when you look good so don't forget to try make sure every time you look good you don't need to break the bank to look good just make sure you do your best to look good this oil is going to add to your beauty just make sure you give it a try don't forget I'm here to ask and to answer any question you may have also don't forget to look for the formula in the description box also for the text version of this demonstration also look in the description box for my beauty blog where you can get more and more information about how to look beautiful and how to look radiant thanks so much for watching don't forget to click the subscribe button and the notification icon to be notified when I upload new video thank you for watching